So we are now in the pantry. <laughs> All the shelves are gone. Look at all the holes. Can you see all the holes? There's holes everywhere. So Chris needs to patch all of it before the people can finish this pantry. So here's the materials for our uh, pantry. I guess that's the one that's going like this. And these are the shelves for it so hopefully I would like it because it's kind of thick so hopefully it's not gonna take so much space inside the pantry they remove the baseboard all the way there so here's the finished pantry goes all the way up close to the ceiling but there's still a little space up there it is now time for me to put everything back over here <laughs> Oh my, there's gonna be a lot of work. I already started putting the some of the appliances in there. So hopefully everything will fit. The one that I'm not using all the time, I will put it up there. So let's do this because there's gonna be a lot of work. Look at the whole kitchen is a mess. Hopefully, I can do this. So, let's put this one. Oh my goodness, this one is heavy. This is the um, Instapot. Let's put this over here. See, this is Instapot. And I used that already. Maybe next time I will make something and show you like this one here uh sous -vide, this one we use that when we put um when we cook like a steak and put it on a special uh like a bag plastic bag and we use this one to uh i don't know how it's like make it like really really tender so let's put this in the middle and make sure it looks nice nicely and it, this is custom made for the size of the I guess this is the one that he measured for the cabinet or for the space however you call that all right guys here is our finish pantry oh my gosh it took me almost three hours to finish it i even managed to put a carpet or area rug in there oh that's a lot of work so let's see what we did these are the um achuete powder and all my sinigang mix and some more stuff up here and this is where i put my list when i uh needed something for grocery shopping i put it there and this frame is from chris's mom and so i put all the stuff that i don't need all the time up there and so these are the section for all of our appliances and i will leave this 
ladder here just for this pantry so if I needed something from up there that's always here and I put the rice dispenser on that corner I was like thinking I said man what am I gonna put over there so perfect for that rice dispensers because it doesn't fit inside this you know inside this uh, cabinet or whatever shelf you call that shelf or cabinet so I am going to put a hook there to put all my apron and so it's organized by category <laughs> now my OCD is gonna be good all the noodles are on that basket and these are all the snacks and some stuff that you know I just put every I mean uh, I just put randomly stuff on that bin and all the grits and oatmeal I just put that there but over here I still have a space for more canned goods and this is the bin for my potatoes onions garlic I need to go shopping because I run out of onions and garlic and I put the uh, uh, what they call that coolers that we always use and down here is very important since I burned the kitchen before <laughs> I didn't tell you guys that I burned the kitchen like uh, two three months ago so Chris got me this uh, EC um, fire extinguisher so I put that here for easy access but knock on wood I hope it won't happen again I pray it won't happen again <laughs> So all my canned goods and I still have a lot of space, lots of space for my canned goods. And all my canisters up there. And over here are all the s random stuff again. And all over here all the coffee and um pancake syrup this bin is just all nuts different kind of nuts this bin is just all vinegar I have a lot of different kind of vinegar as you can tell I love vinegar and over here are just all the sauces different kind of sauces and this one is just all oil different kind of oil there's extra virgin olive oil coconut oil another olive oil cooking oil what is this peanut oh avocado oil then peanut oil right there all the way in the back and these are the different kinds of soy sauce and fish sauce, marine sauce, and over here, all the peanut butter, mayo, and all kinds of stuff. And this one are just the boxes stuff. Boxes stuff. <laughs> this one, chalice snacks and um, treats, and this. Versus snacks and me snacks and treats so they're the same level <laughs> I hope we won't eat this for our treat <laughs> so but anyway guys I am loving it I thought I would not love it but I'm loving it right now I am very happy so it's all organized and over here, I hang this barb. Uh, what they call this when you barbecue something, when you grill something, and you put that. 
So I just put it there and all my shopping bags. And here's the finished pantry, guys. Thank you so much for watching. I'll see you guys on our next video. Bye for now.